What is up guys, this is Gersh1 and I'm here with The Sound Alchemist And this is the video that you've been waiting for all week We are going to do our 3D hero clip map battle report And then at the end, we're going to choose the winner And don't forget that, guys that all this is in honor of our patron campaign We are starting it today So there's going to be a link right on the bottom in the description For you to take, to take you into the patron page where you guys can see the awesome goodies as well as extra battle reports with this 3D map and uh, some more good stuff. So do not forget to check out the patron page. So first, let's explain the battle report. Um, I am playing the Deadpool family, kind of. It's a Deadpool and dog pool. And then he's playing. I'm playing Spider-Man and Hope Summers, bringing that Avengers vs. X-Men theme. So it's a 200 point battle report, and it's going to be a ton of fun. I cannot wait. This, ba this battle is going to be so amazing. Spider-Man vs. Deadpool. Who will win? So let's go straight to the figures and the cards. Alright, these are the figures that I am using. I have Deadpool and Dogpool, both with the Thought Bubble. Uh, special trait basically uh, I get a free action at the beginning of the game and I can choose between these three thought bubbles that I can use hopefully these guys do good what am I saying they are gonna do good it's the mark with the mouth combating the Deadpool figures I have Hope Summers and Spider-Man here I'm planning on using Hope to copy Spider-Man's abilities and take down that dastardly Deadpool. And this is a quick view, finally, of the map that we're doing, the 3D map. So you have a little like tower right there. You have these things, which in the beginning they were supposed to be heavy objects where you could just pick them up. Um, but since none of our guys have super strength, they're just gonna be places um, to count as hindering terrain. So if I have a character here, and there's a character on this side trying to shoot through this rock, it's gonna count as hindering terrain. Uh, and then none of our guys have stealth, so that's not important. This is just a big piece of impassable terrain. Sorry for the paint job on the green. It will improve. And then on this side, it's just uh, kind of like a little, little alley. All right, this is the roll-off. First, it's the Deadpool family. Eight. Eight. All right, let's go Hope, Summers, and Spidey. Oh, no. seven. Let's take a look at these amazing sculpts from the new Deadpool set. All right, ready? And this is his starting line. Let's begin. All right, Deadpool is going to move or run. So it's gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and. 10 right here and then dog pool is going to move his eight so one two three four five six seven and eight woof, woof. all right starting off this match i'm scared of spider-man spidey abilities i really don't know what this figure has to offer so i'm going to be cautious i'm going to hide behind as much stuff as i can all right, Hope Summers is gonna use her jetpack, which means she can use charge and the flight ability. And she will carry Spider-Man. So the 10 becomes an eight movement. One, two, three, four, five, six. And she will use her power mimic. I could give Hope Summers a free action and choose a standard power possessed by any character within four squares. She can use that power until my next turn as if she had a range value of 6. So I will copy Spider-Man's Super Senses. Alright, I got Hope, I got Spider-Man, there's gonna be Super Senses everywhere. I don't think I'll be hit at all this game. Bring it, Deadpool. Alright, I am going to start off the match by giving Dogpool a Thought Bubble. It is the... I'm going to lick your hand, Thought Bubble. Where is it? Right here. So I'm gonna put it right there. Right there. And um, basically it says he does plus one to his breakaway. 
Um, because I have plans for him. So I'm going to clear him. Deadpool is going to run in shot. One, two, three, four. Five, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So he is in range to shoot Spider Man. Ten, or sorry, eleven on a seventeen with super senses to do four damage. So I have to roll a six. Oh, starting off the match pretty strong. Desperately need the super senses. Let me get that five or six. Ah! What happened? Oh. So he takes um, four damage, so it's one, two, three, four, and then he gets knocked back for one, two, and then he hits. So we've agreed that um, because these are steps, technically he would hit this, and then it, it would hurt him. So he's going to hit here, stop. Oh, take the one for um, having the, the six, the crit hit. And then he gets another damage then because he hit that. Killing Spider-Man. Just a quick recap then. So it was four damage, plus one for crit hit, and then plus one for hitting the wall. That's a total of six damage. First turn, Spider-Man is dead. Wow, I am I am shocked. And unfortunately, you had super senses, so it did not help you when you hit that wall. Wow, I was not expecting that. This is probably never going to happen again in the history of One Mind Syndicate. Six damage first turn, knocking out a crucial, crucial figure. It probably won't ever happen again. Awesome, awesome feeling. After that devastating attack... I lost all hope, and I'm just going to clear and hope for the best. All right, uh, Deadpool is going to have to clear. He was right here, right? Yeah. And um, Dogpool is actually going to run up to base. Hope. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Because I don't want her to charge Deadpool next turn. So he's going to be my sacrificial dog. I will use Hope's Power Mimic, copying your Precision Strike. What this does is, when this character makes an attack, it can't be evaded and the damage cannot be reduced one or transferred. So, that being said, your Super Senses is no more. It is a 10 on a 16. I need a 6 to do 2. Oh! <laughs> so close. Now what I'm going to do, Dog Pool has a special damage power called Bark. Dog can use Perplex. But only to perplex people's defense down. So I'm going to perplex uh, Hope's defense down to a 16. Um, and then with that, I am going to running shot. Hopefully I can. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so Deadpool is doing 11 on a 16 to do four damage. He's killing it. What is it, what is it? Seven, there it is. <laughs> seven, sorry. Seven, uh, so I needed a five. So four damage. This is not looking good. One, two, three, four. These click really nice. And then Dogpool is going to clear. Hey Deadpool, what are you looking at? I got no choice but to willpower her and attack Dogpool. She does have Precision Strike, so now she will be doing nine on a 16. I need a seven to do two. And I got it. So let's see, one, two. Now I will use her power mimic to copy your super senses and perplex my defense up to a 16. Ah, fuck. Your move. Hope, I will not lose hope. I gotta stay strong. All right, now, Dogpool is going to decide to uh, attack with blade, claws, and fangs. <laughs> 
So I have to do a 9 on a 16 with super senses to do whatever blades gets me. So 9 on a 16, I have to roll a 7. That is a miss. 6. I miss. Now, I'm kind of bummed out that the thought bubbles aren't really helping me at all, but I'm winning, so it doesn't really feel that bad. <laughs> it's okay, have no fear, Deadpool is here, and I'm going to push Deadpool to do running shot. One, two, three. Seven on a 16 with super senses, or sorry, 11 on a 16 with super senses. So I gotta roll a four. Got it. And uh, roll your super senses, my good friend. Oh. Miss. So I gotta, or four damage. I think this is it. One, two, three, four. Oh. Hope is done. Flawless victory. Well, I did it. I feel good. You've been on a really bad losing streak. I, I have. Um, I, good for me. I feel good. Flawless victory, but uh, tell me what you guys thought of the map. Um, sorry for the green pillars. I needed more uh, coats of paint on it. I didn't have enough time, but tell me what you guys thought of the map. It's really cool because it's modular, so you could actually move it around. It was tons of fun to play. What did you think? I loved it. Um, even though I lost horribly, I had a ton of fun. The map was amazing. I saw the Deadpool figures in action. Yep, yep. Comment down below if you have any cool ideas of future 3D maps. And what I mean by that is kind of which ones would have cool gaming mechanics that we could implement into the game. Because right now they're just structures. So it's basically like elevated terrain, uh, blocking terrain, and kind of hindering terrain. But if you have some cool ideas, comment down below, tell us, and see if we can construct a mega amazing um, 3D map. Now that you guys have finished watching this awesome battle report, the fun does not end there. Head over to our Patreon page where you guys fund us to give back to you guys the amazingness of Hero Clicks. It is really, really amazing. Just click the button. You like it. Click the button. You know this is an amazing battle report. Like the hell out of it. Share it. Comment. Do everything to this battle report. We are One Mind Syndicate. This is Gershwan. I am the Sound Alchemist. We are signing out. Out. Psych, just playing. Nah. <laughs> we still have to announce the winners of the um, raffle giveaway contest thing. You got that Shuma Gorath? Gorath? Growth? Growth? Shuma. 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 Yeah. Let's keep stalling. Build up anticipation. Mm. Let's see who won. Alright guys, no more waiting. We are done playing with you guys. Uh, let's announce the winners of the giveaway. Uh, but first, uh, let's read some of the funny comments that we got. Alright, the first funny comment that we got, we got uh, it was by Jack Burton. Um, and he said, One Mind Syndicate, the guys that defied MC Hammer and touched it. This next one is by Burton. This next one is by Jack Burton. Knock knock. Who's there? Interrupting doctor. Interrupting. You have cancer. <laughs> <laughs> this next one is by Christopher Holt. How many tickles does it take to make an octopus laugh? How many? Tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> this next one is kind of funny, but also very untrue. It's by Jason McFadden. 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 <laughs> The Flash is the most disappointing hero for the ladies when it comes to bedroom antics. What with his being the fastest. That's actually not true. Not true at all. Because if you think about it, if he's the fastest, he can just do this. <laughs> and if you if you know what I'm saying. And then you can translate that to the tongue. I'm not going to do the tongue thing, but like... This next one is by Aku. Aku. Master of Masters. I love Aku. And what does he say, Gersh? He says... Give me the fucking points and the giveaway. Not this time. Not this time. You didn't win, sorry. This next one is by Married with Clicks. I've been watching you guys for a while. You guys are, you guys are funny, funny. Um, you guys ask, what software do we use? 
Uh, we use Final Cut Pro 10. I use Final Cut Pro 10. You can also use Sony Vegas 9, I think. I used that one before. That one's really good um, software. But yeah, either one of those two. Your guys' videos can improve a lot if you guys use that. I wonder what you guys are using. Comment down below. Um, and then if you guys want to do collaboration videos, hit us up. Alright, and then the next comment comes from... Nolam. This guy has been a subscriber for a really long time. I, I recognize that name since the beginning. But he writes, How do you keep Gersh1 in suspense? The same way we're keeping you guys in suspense. So, if you guys get mad that this video is really long, blame, blame Nolam. Blame him. Yeah. Alright guys, finally let's announce the main winner. But first, thank you for every comment. We read them, we laughed. Uh, you guys are awesome. Sorry for keeping you guys waiting. Make sure to check out the patron page. All right, let's announce it. All right, the winner is Edric McKnight. Yeah, yeah. Edric McKnight. He um, he just just started HeroClick videos too. I think. Thanks um, to us, I think he said. So there you go, helping one of you guys join HeroClicks. That's what we're here for. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. So you won, Mr. Edric McKnight. So what you're gonna have to do now is either email us at one mind syndicate the number one at or one mind syndicate the number one at gmail.com, um, and then give us your uh, address so we can come visit you and kill you. No, so we can mess so we can ship your thing out. Um, but yeah, so definitely hit us up. Last time we did a giveaway, two people didn't hit us up. And they never got their prizes, so if you want your prize, uh, hit us up. Edric, if you do not contact us within a week of this Friday, which is 23rd, so if you don't contact us by the 29th, our runner-up is... The Arzola 77. So if, um, for whatever reason, you don't choose it, Arzola 77, be ready, because you're going to be the one to get the prize. So if you want to find this McKnight fella, kill him, gut him, so you can win this prize. We can't really stop you from doing that. We don't recommend you do that, though. We are not promoting any type of violence on our channel. Once again, a big thank you to all the commenters, all the subscribers, everybody. Just a big thank you. And um, we would thank you even more if you checked out our Patreon page, Come or click on the video link down below. And uh, yeah, be ready for next week when we bring you more badass videos. This was Gershwan, the Sound Alchemist, signing off.